This is going to be the final matchup for the Sriracha Bracket. It's going to be Texas Pete versus Underwood Ranch. And the winner is going to go on to face Buffalo Classica in the final four of the Hot Sauce Challenge. Now, again, I'm using the same oysters I've always had. These are Double T Oyster Ranch oysters grown right in Tall Timbers, which is literally about two miles down the road from my house. And overall, I've been really pleased with these oysters. I like the fact that they're bigger, which means you don't just have to eat them raw. They're actually really good oysters to grill too. I've done a lot of different grill recipes with these that I've really enjoyed. And I feel like the oyster when cooked is actually a little bit sweeter than say like a wild caught Chesapeake Bay oyster. So after I got both of these oysters ready for the hot sauce, first up, I put the Texas Pete on one of the oysters and then I moved to the Underwood Ranch. Now I'm kind of curious because before I said the Texas Pete was the best sauce. First I tried the Texas Pete and honestly for some reason I was a little bit underwhelmed. It's not as good as I remember. It was still good but the Underwood Ranch just tasted a lot better. I'm gonna have to go with the Underwood Ranch as the winner of the 